Psalms 78, 20. Behold, he smote the rock that the waters gushed out and streams overflowed. Can he give bread also? Can he provide flesh for his people? This verse clearly shows the failure of man in thinking with his intelligence how far God can work. God can make possible things which others think impossible. God not only really does create, but he uses his creations the way he likes. The miracles that God did for the people of Israel when they were redeemed from Egypt and were in the wilderness are clear evidences of it. We do not see a God who once created the earth and man and does not intervene, but a God who constantly intervenes in his creations. This God can intervene in every aspect of our life. But God likes us to welcome him happily for this. Do you wish for a miracle from God today? If so, submit wholeheartedly for God to act. Pray in God's presence with faith. Declare that God who split the sea prepared way for his people in the middle of it and led them in the pillar of cloud and fire will do miracle in my life too. Where there was no water in the desert, when God commanded and struck the rock, water flowed out like a river which quenched the thirst of the people and was useful for other purposes. They flowed like streams to the tents where they lived. But when they were hungry, they doubted if God could provide them food. They found it difficult to believe in God who provided water from the rock in the wilderness would provide them food too. These are the lessons for us to believe that God can work miracles of yesterday for us even to this day. Let us be faithful and enjoy the miracles. May God bless you.